This program contains scenes with coarse language and mature subject matter. Viewer discretion is advised. Basically, there's three groups of people we have in this society. Group one, who don't smoke, drink, don't even take prescription drugs. They don't get high at all. Now, I don't know how they do it. <laughs> yeah, you know, the first thing, uh, sun's up, work, 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 dark, sleep, 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 sleep. I don't know how they do it. I, I mean, I tried to be in group one for a while, but one more euchre game and boom, you know. I don't know how they do it. Then we have group two, which I assume most of us are in group two. Yeah, we like to have a smoke, drink, whatever, but uh, we seem to show up for work the next day, right? Have our bills paid, whatever. And then we have group three. Now, these are the people who end up on A&E's intervention, like, oh, where's my baby? You know, you know, kind of people that wouldn't be good on the price of right. And the actual retail price for the home entertainment unit is $2,500. I would only get $300 for that. Uh, are you okay? Yeah. All right. Now, I think it's our moral obligation for group one and two to help people in group three out. And also, I think for group two, it's our practical obligation to help people in group three because they're screwing it up for us, right? Every time group three flip out, group one goes, no drugs for anybody. <laughs> oh, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Get the rehab shut up. No, no, it's okay. It's okay. He's going to see a doctor. Yeah, it's okay. <laughs> really, it's okay. We have to find who is predestined to be in group three. Right? Now, a very, very simple way that I found out. All you have to do is find out at what age kids get high in our society. Now, what age do you think kids first get high in our society? 14, <laughs> what a dream world you're living in. <laughs> Anyone else? 12, no. Three. He's right, three. Don't you remember? It's between the ages of two and four, three, perfect. I would bet a million bucks everybody in this house got high the first time between two and four. Your first altered state as a kid. group two we spun around we spun around we fell down we puked then we got up and we went okay there's a limit okay a couple of spins and then we gotta sit down all righty we'll only spin on the weekends that's good for those kids that destined to be in group three, they spun around, they spun around, they fell and they puked and they got right back up. You know, they kept on spinning, puke, kept on spinning, puke, kept on spinning. It's like, I'm sorry, here's your helmet. <laughs> yeah, you gotta go to rehab. Same thing nowadays, we wanna find out who's gonna be that psycho, the next guy to flip out and start shooting people. That's a good thing to know, huh? Forget all the research and all, all that stuff too. Again with this, you know. And my, I remember when I was seven years old, my father was in the Canadian Air Force, and we were stationed in Halifax, and we had a science fair day, you know. And they had animals and stuff, and they had this one guy in a booth. And he had a big boa constrictor snake, and he goes, "Hey, you kids, you want to see me feed the snake?" And I'm like, we're all seven, you know. We're like we got cats and dogs. I, I, I had a, a copper spaniel, you know. And we, and we thought there'd just be snake food. They open up the tin and feed it, you know? What the hell did we know? We were seven, right? Guy pulls out this big box of live baby chicks. 
Yeah, exactly. Exactly. He takes one of the chicks, puts it in with the snake. I swear the snake was sleeping, but as soon as that chick got in there, the snake woke up and wrapped it around him for five or six times, and then swallowed the chick whole. Now the kid on the right of me, he just goes, oh my God. <laughs> he was out before he hit the grass. Now, but it's nice to know that this kid's not gonna grow up and kill people, is he? But the kid on the left of me, you go, feed it again. Thank you. I've always had a great time here. Thank you so much. God bless you.